Hello, everyone. This is Han Hu. It's my honor to introduce String Panda, a string analysis tool that provides linked reconstruction of string composition and gene content profiles via pan genome based decomposition of metagenomic data. As we know, multiple within species variants coexist in microbiomes, which can have substantial variations in their gene contents. Those variations can lead to substantial phenotypic differences and play an important role in microbial adaptation across environments and host microbiome interaction. Currently, most string level analysis tools focus on string composition based on single nucleotide variants. Current pan genome based tools such as PanFlan only infer the gene content of dominant strain. Therefore, we need a method to simultaneously reconstruct the composition and the gene contents of coexisting strains from metagenomic data. Here we have strain panda, strain level pan genome decomposition analysis. Strain panda is able to decompose the gene family abundance data matrix into a matrix of gene content profile and a matrix of strain composition. Here is the full workflow of string panda. First, pan genome references of selected species were pre-built and annotated with public databases. Second, sequencing reads were mapped to pan genome databases to generate the gene family abundance data matrix D for each selected species. After decomposition, the gene content profile matrix P was annotated to give functional interpretation of the strains. We designed the following study to evaluate the performance of string panda. We first validated performance using synthetic mixtures of multiple strains. We simulated datasets of different sequencing depths, sequencing errors, and background metagenomes. We then benchmarked string panda with other string analysis tools such as string EST, PString, and PanFlan. Finally, we apply string panda to longitudinal metagenomic datasets, including an infant gut microbiome dataset and a post FMD gut microbiome datasets. The validation results showed that string panda can accurately infer string composition and provide comparable performance to other SMV based tools. In addition, string panda provides accurate inference of gene content profile of coexisting strains while other tools cannot provide such information. The results show that predicted gene content profile was close to the ground truth and much better than random guess. In case study number one, we applied string panda to an infant gut microbiome dataset. We discovered a clear pattern of a shift in the dominant B. longum subspecies over time, which was associated with breastfeeding status change. We further looked at the gene content profiles of the subspecies. We found distinct nutrient utilization genes among the subspecies. Specifically, subspecies one had the unique gene families that are key enzymes related to human milk oligosaccharides. In case study number two, we apply string panda to dataset from Crohn's disease patients treated with FMT. We found strong individual signatures using predicted subspecies compositional profiles. We also identified two BioVata subspecies that had opposite association trends with BioVata species and distinct enrichment patterns with FMT outcome. Notably, subspecies 2 had more CASI gene families and string specific virulence factor genes, which may contribute to its competitive advantages and association with post FMT relapse. In summary, first, string panda is a novel method that reconstructs the string composition and the gene contents with high accuracy and robustness compared to state of the art methods. Second, linked reconstruction of string composition and the gene contents is crucial for understanding the relationship between microbial adaptation and string specific function. Finally, string panda can be assessed from GitHub. You are welcome to use the tool and provide valuable feedback to us. That's all I have for today. Thank you all for listening. And a special thanks to Meta for publishing our work.